Hey guys, okay, day two of the Hermetica Parasite colon cleanse. Would you believe that I actually passed something yesterday? Um, I'm debating if I should show the video or show the picture or not. Like it's, it's kind of gross, but damn, I, like something actually came out and it was, I had it like, it was two, like a day, you know, like it's crazy. Um, it was like worm and it was long and it was disgusting, but it was motivation to keep going. So I can't, I couldn't believe like something actually came out and I had a feeling I had parasites and while I was going through a list of some of the symptoms and stuff and so many of them just checked out. And again, the, the gut, the gut problems, man, like this is just a really good reset. Um, day two has been really challenging. It started off good and then it just kind of like went down a little bit. I was super irritable for a big chunk of the day. Like I could not talk uh, to people, especially my family, because I would just, I noticed that I was snapping, but I was so self-aware that like I was observing myself like and my tone and all of that and how it would change and stuff and how I was really like quick to get annoyed and angry and stuff but uh, you know you're not eating so things are changing um it's been interesting because i was just reading something online and they gave a beautiful analogy about fasting and a lot of my family is like what the hell are you doing like they don't they don't get it they're like oh it's dangerous and stuff but actually fasting is one of like the best things that you can probably do for your body especially if you're feeling sick and stuff just naturally we your body doesn't want to eat when you're sick right and i noticed that a week before i started the cleanse my appetite started changing and like i just wasn't eating as much and i just felt sick so I'm glad I'm doing this as much as I'm like, I could smash some french fries right now, some chips. And that's another thing I'm noticing all my cravings, man. Like I, I, I want salty things and like anything fried. So I'm really attracted to shit food basically. <laughs> and I'm um, happy to break that kind of addiction. And I'm, I'm, I'm noticing that food was kind of this uh, reward mechanism for me too. You know, you do something, you're like, cool, I get this like piece of chocolate later or like, oh, whatever, because I'm going out for dinner tonight, you know? Um, and that's another thing, the social aspect of it. I was supposed to go out with a friend tonight and my other friends are out right now, but I opted not to because so much of, you know, our entertainment it surrounds food and, and drinks and stuff. So, and you know, you're going through a cleanse right now, you're going through a fast, so it's just like kind of better to just chill out and just relax a little bit. I've been meditating a lot, so that's been really good. I'm noticing that my mind is, um, it's going. It's like a lot of these weird memories uh, are coming up and I had to actually look it up online because I'm like, what? What is happening? Because I know like things are happening, but I just, I couldn't understand. And the best analogy that I found was, um, imagine a grocery store um, that was closed for a week, but the employees still came to work and it's kind of crazy right but think about all the stuff that the employees could get done while not having to deal with customers they could repaint the walls they could change all the shelves they could restock everything properly so similar to our body while, while our body is not focused and worrying about digesting and eliminating and absorbing uh, it could do other things you know um and that's how i kind of took it so that's been interesting Tomorrow's day three. I'm looking forward to it because it's like, whoa, it's day three already. Um, and then two more days after that. But I got so much crap done in my house, um, cleared a bunch of boxes, threw out a bunch of clothes. And it just happened naturally. You know, there's not that there was no like mental like, should I? Oh, OK, I'll do this instead. Like, blah, blah, blah. It was just like, no, this is what I'm doing right now. And I have so much more time because, you know, I'm not cooking or cleaning or making or eating and stuff. So, I don't know, man. Eating is really time consuming, I noticed, but yeah. So anyway, that's a quick little update of day two. And yeah, so let's see how day three goes. Thanks.